Cameo Magic presents whiteboard explanations. This video will provide the description, the purpose, and the vision of the digital transformation. The digital transformation is converting from a legacy method to a digital approach. Music transitioning from analog to digital is a good analogy to help highlight the advantages of the end result of a digital transformation. There are three phases to the digital transformation. The first is the commitment to the transition from a document-based approach to a model-based approach. This requires leadership support and a cultural shift. The second is struggling over the discontinuities. Significant collaboration is essential to create a consistent and standardized methodology, language, and toolset. Third, connections, or threads, can be built. This is where good solutions emerge. Engineering disciplines, such as mechanical engineering, has transitioned from document-centric to model-centric. The digital transformation is about converting all of the engineering disciplines to a digital approach. Once all of the discipline's model data resides on an environment, the data can be connected and passed seamlessly from one source to another. The seamless exchange of data between software tools is completed using a digital thread. All engineering domains such as mechanical engineering, electrical engineering, software engineering and systems engineering will subscribe to the digital thread. The digital thread creates an authoritative source of truth for all aspects of data regarding the system of interest. Specific engineering disciplines will be able to gather and utilize relevant and current system data. This data exchange requires all parties involved to be working on the same digital engineering environment or ecosystem. The digital thread can also be thought of as a conference room table. Every engineering discipline gets a seat at the table and is able to announce or publish new data. Other disciplines sitting at the table can listen or subscribe to specific datasets. The digital layer allows for engineers to publish as soon as new data becomes available rather than waiting until a specific meeting time. The conference room is analogous to a shared digital engineering environment. The table is analogous to a model manager tool which helps manage the flow of data and the configuration. The digital thread is analogous to the combination of the engineers, the conference room table, and all of the interactions between parties. The digital thread takes on a hub and spokes configuration. An integrated model manager will act as a broker between data repositories within the digital engineering environment. The integrated model manager represents the hub while the other engineering tools represent the spokes. The integrated model manager will be connected, or linked, to each of the software tools. This connection will require data transformations and mappings. The integrated model manager will be responsible for pushing and pulling from software to software and version control of the entire digital environment. The alternative to a model-based approach is a document-based approach where all of the data is written in a document rather than saved within computer models. There are several advantages to a model-based approach over a document-based approach, which include enhanced clarity and visualization, consistency and synchronization, ease of updates, automation and analysis ability, ease of collaboration, and enhanced evolution of systems. Note, there are some drawbacks to a model-based approach due to the added complexities, but the benefits will outweigh the drawbacks as a system's complexity increases. You might ask, how do systems engineers fit into the digital transformation? Because systems engineers are responsible for the centralization and standardization of information, they are responsible for extending the digital thread. Additionally, systems engineers sweep all engineering domains and act as the information broker between technical subject matter experts and high-level leadership. Systems Modeling Language, or SysML, is an easily understood graphical language used by systems engineers which is meant to bridge this gap between low-level and high-level personnel. SysML can be modeled on several different software tools including Cameo, MagicDraw, Rhapsody, and many more. The chosen systems engineering software tool is then integrated into the rest of the digital thread. There are three levels of compatibility which need to occur for a successful digital transformation to be possible. Let's look at each in more detail. First and most granular in scope is project-to-project -project compatibility. This includes the ability for different projects within a single tool to connect and operate seamlessly. For systems engineers, a common language and methodology needs to be established. Even if the same tool and language are selected, differing methodologies may render projects incompatible. Second, is tool-to-tool -tool compatibility. The expected data flowing between tools must have the correct mapping, units, and syntax. The digital thread can help with data transformations as necessary but this all needs to be set up manually. Extending the thread and making these inputs and outputs, or hooks, between tools compatible can be difficult and tedious. Third and largest in scope is environment-to-environment -environment compatibility. Each company will typically have their own environment. For example, when delivering models from subcontractor to prime contractor, both environments need to be reviewed. If the environments are not set up in the same manner, there will likely be compatibility errors. Please pause the video and review some of the notes compiled regarding the key aspects and importance of the digital transformation. Here's some more notes regarding the vision for the digital transformation. Please check the links in the description for additional helpful white papers and publications regarding this topic. 
We have also added links to our other whiteboard explanation videos in the description. We hope you found the content helpful. Please comment, like, and subscribe.